Hey what's going on guys, it's Tom here, back today with another video and back with the start of a new series, something a little bit similar to something I've done before, but I hope you guys will agree that this actually looks a little bit better than the one I actually did last year. So you guys have probably worked out I'm going to be covering all the guns that could be coming in Black Ops 2, and the first one we're going to be covering today is the XM8. So this actually looks like one of the main guns that's going to be appearing in the single play. You can see the two screenshots on the right hand side, and in both of them pictures the guy is actually holding the XM8. The XM8 is an assault rifle. Country of origin is actually Germany. It was made for the US Army, but it was actually made in Germany. It was designed in 2002 and then was actually built as a prototype between 2003 and 2004. In 2005, it was then stopped production. So it looks like in Black Ops 2, they're going to be assuming that it resumed production after the current day. This manufacturer, as I said, was a German manufacturer. It was the pretty famous Heckler & Koch. They've produced a lot of famous guns. Probably going to be seeing a lot more of their guns as this series goes on. Now, the rate of fire on the XMA is a pretty standard for the assault rifle, 750 rounds per minute. And the cartridge is the 5.56 by 45 millimeter NATO round. And typically, it comes with the 30 round detachable box magazine. However, it can have the 100 round magazine, but I don't think we're going to be seeing that in game. I'd imagine that we're going to be seeing the pretty standard 30 round detachable box magazine. So there it is, guys. That's the first gun we're going to be covering in this series. I'm going to be doing this over the coming months. As new guns are revealed, I'm going to be covering all of them, giving you all the stats. The stats in real life are probably going to reflect the stats that we're going to see in game. That's why I'm doing it like that. But I just want to confirm the guns, show you a few screenshots, and just show you a few cool graphics. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. If you could like and favorite the video, it really helps me out. I've worked super hard on doing this series. So hopefully you guys can show your appreciation by doing that. Also, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, if you're not watching this on my channel, make sure you head over to my channel. The link should be in the top of the description. 